Good morning everyone, my name's Adriana, excuse the crazy hair, I'm just trying to sort it out but I wanted to do this video real quick, let me just, alright forget about it. Anyway, so this video is basically about reviews uh, that I found online, you know, from coffee shops, supermarkets, restaurants, uh, I mean, me personally before i actually go somewhere i actually do like to check out reviews first just to see if it's you know worth my money if it's actually good that's it whether it's actually decent or not so i actually like to check reviews but there's another reason why i like to check reviews and that's because some reviews are absolutely hilarious and i did find some and i had to show it with you guys some of them are with google translate from greek to english because i am in greece and then some are just you know in english but really funny and witty comments my kind of sense of humor if you don't like that this kind of sense of humor leave because that's what this video is about anyway let's get started first and last chinese restaurant i visited in greece the soup was okay and the rice was okay but the roasted duck wasn't so okay the meat glibbery and hard to eat and the duck had more bones than meat probably wasn't a diet Stuff was very nice. This is actually hilarious. What does glibbery mean? Does anyone know the word glibbery? This pasta is glibbery. The staff, very kind, but the honors as in the whole chain are with God. I also got a burger pie, which finally left a pretty big bitter taste in my mouth. I do not know why. Oh my god. <laughs> ah. Too slow servant, very dumb. Right. That day, I needed coffee to wake up. And the girl who made it, the same. Look, we've all had those days, okay? Some of us even turn up to work drunk or hungover. We don't want to serve you some damn coffee, but we have to get paid. Staff is unacceptable. We waited 10 minutes to order and 15 while there was no world. The food is moderate, half the potatoes are cold. Wow, okay and irrelevant girl in coffee. <laughs> wow. Good. Good. Yeah. For a poor pork straw with shoe sole for 180 pieces. I don't think I'll go back. There are much better and cheaper ones. good food a little rug the place of course but you can't have them all basically there isn't a little rug in the place <laughs> he's talking about the place being crap never been there i wonder why google asks me for a review google what are you up to god there is always a god and there is always a man. He must have had a terrible experience for him to literally just try God. You wait a lot in the cash even if you do not have a world. But Google Translate, 10 out of 10 for this. 10 out of 10, I love it. Sclavenitis and the birds of milk. It's literal translation. I don't even get what this guy means by that because I've never heard that phrase before. Even though I'm Greek, doesn't mean I know all the phrases that everybody uses, but cool, it's the birds of milk. Horny. <laughs> Horny. Google's horny, clearly. Foolish, kind staff. 
easy access to the shop even for people with disabilities. Many good deals. I don't know why Google decided to be dramatic. Very good supermarket with noble sellers, a little awkward. The rulers are ignorant. Rulers <laughs> are ignorant. Well, honey, welcome to politics. Am I right? Well, I hope you enjoyed the reviews as I did. And if it did make you laugh, I'm sorry, it made me laugh. But I wanted to share it with you guys. And the point of this message is that Google Translate is not always accurate. Check out reviews because they're hilarious. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Have a great day.